oh my gosh, there's water pouring in from this side. Because all the, oh my gosh, look at it, this side. Babe, we're gonna sink. Oh my gosh, look at it, babe. <laughs> oh no, I better get the bucket. <laughs> I'm Abby, and this is Cole, and we are the custodians of a Halverson 25 named Memory. We got memory due to not being able to go on a honeymoon, so we decided to take on this project and we have not looked back since. We've enjoyed learning everything there is to know about building a timber boat and have met so many beautiful people along the way. Explain to me your whoopsie. Whoopsie. Oh yeah, we have an engine. And the most exciting news ever, we've got a little skipper joining the team. So we pretty much had all our portholes still um, intact, just like this one here. Um, they were all in really good nick and just need to be re-chromed, but everything was, was really nice. We were just missing one of these rectangular portholes. Um, now we probably could have searched around and found one in a shed somewhere or something that you know, that someone didn't need to use or had a spare. But instead of doing that, we got in touch, in touch with a company called Southern Stainless based up here on the Gold Coast. And we basically gave them one of these and one of our round ones. And our idea was we wanted to reproduce all of these on the internal of our portholes. So I wanted a whole bunch of flat ones. So basically you have one on the outside and one on the inside, and I think it'll just be a nice bit of jewelry on the inside. Um, so we had them recreate a whole bunch of those that are flat, and then we also had them 3D model this channel that's in here. Um, Cause there's, this, there's something called a Bailey channel that sits in here, and the window basically slides back and forth, and that stops any water from coming through. So it's quite a bit of work in getting all that right and everything. So that's our one here that they've reproduced so they've got pretty awesome technology and machines and yeah they're superb craftsmen there so it's pretty nice to have all that new little bits and bobs and we'll get all these chromed and they'll match that these are 316 stainless these are br bronze bronze so yeah I think all in all pretty good job you look amazing Southern stainless artisans in metal. <laughs> Still <didn't> like that. <laughs> So we're back at the boat. It's been a couple of weeks since we've been here, but the reason is this little guy. 
So this is Knox. He's two weeks old and already in the shed getting some more work done on memory. So now we've got to get things going so we can get out and start to enjoy it. So Cole has done the flooring today, putting the hatches in. We've got the engine coming back soon that will drop in. We've got big things happening. It's good to be back. Yeah. A little bit more motivation now. <laughs> you know, it's really good to be back. Let's a big year ahead so we don't want to start too far behind because then everything gets a bit daunting so we want to stay ahead and get her knocked over this year. Yep. Now we've got little bub. So he came two and a bit weeks early so we weren't quite ready for him yet but so good that he's here. We can show him the boat. Hey little cutie. <laughs> 